So we've been waiting a long time for this. Um, I'll just get out the Brad news first. We're going to continue waiting a long time for this because hmm. the first devices aren't expected until the first half of next year. So what they're announcing today is the X2 Elite and also a second uh, higher-end model called the X2 Elite Extreme. Um, this is not in any of the materials that they're putting out into the world, but talking to people that I know, I discovered that the difference between the X2 Elite and the X2 Elite Extreme is that the latter has the memory built onto the die. This is one of those things with hardware that, I guess it makes sense when you think about it, I don't think most people think about this, but distance matters. And one of the advantages of like say Lunar Lake, uh, as with you know the Apple and Silicon stuff, is that because it's there, the distance that um, things occur between the CPU or whatever processor and the RAM is minuscule. Whereas if it's even if it's right next to it on a board, it's still a distance, right? So there's a, a lag there, if you will. The X2 Elite Extreme targets what they're calling an ultra premium <laughs> PCs, I guess. Um, this is the third gen version of the CPU. The performance differences depend on who you're looking at. So 70 up to 75% faster CPU performance than the competition at ISO power. So I would assume the competition means Intel AMD. 